So for problem number three, Judy's find jewelry receive an invoice for 50 silver charm bracelet for a total of 27,500. The invoice is dated April 1. She received the bracelets on April 6. If the terms are 310 ROG and the invoice is paid on April 11, how much will she pay? So let's analyze the um, given values for the word problem. Ano ba yung mga values that we need in solving and ano yung mga values na hindi natin kailangan since we have a lot of dates and we have a lot of numbers included in this problem. So, first, let's analyze this 50 silver charm bracelet. Obviously, hindi siya kasama sa given. Bakit? Pampagulo lang. Kasi, sinabi lang naman na 50 yung bracelets na um, in order niya. So, Hindi yun, hindi natin, hindi natin yun kailangan para makapag-solve later on. Then, what we need is this 27,500. Bakit? Kasi this is the amount written in the invoice. Ito yung halaga nung 50 silver na charm bracelet. So, this 27,500 is our net price. Kasi yan yung amount na nakalagay sa invoice. Next, the invoice is dated April 1. Since this is under ROG, we don't need this invoice date. Hindi din natin kailangan yung invoice date. But instead, we need the ROG date. So, proceeding, proceeding, she received the bracelets on April 6. O, ayun na. Received on April 6. Meaning, this April 6 makes the ROG date. Okay, sana naiintindihan po. If the terms are 310, so ito yung ating term, and the invoice is paid on April 11, how much will she pay? Given this question, obviously, ang ating hinahanap is amount payable. So, let's now write the given and the find properly. So, our given values for problem number 3 is yung first 27,500 which is the net price like what we've said earlier then April 6 which is the ROG date and then yung kailangan natin isa pa is yung term na 310 so we have to look for kanina in-identify na natin na amount payable because of the question how much will she pay so let's now have the solution so for the solution since we're looking for the amount payable we have to solve for the amount payable using the formula that we used kanina kanina pa na net price 27,500 multiplied by 1 minus. Anong discount rate kaya yung applicable for this given problem? So, let's try to check if 3 is applicable for this discount rate. So, ang sabi, una, our ROG date is April 6. And then, kailan niya nga ulit babayaran? Sabi, babayaran niya daw ng April 11. Ngayon, let's see if pag binayaran niya ng April 11, applicable pa ba yung 3% na Discount. Paano natin yun malalaman? We have to count 10 days after April 6. Kasi within 10 days, applicable pa si 3% na discount. Pagka beyond 10 days na from April 6, edi hindi na applicable yung 3% discount. So, counting 10 days starting April 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. We will come up with the last date na April 16. Ngayon, itong April 11 ba, pasok pa dun sa April 16 na last date? Of course, yes. And obviously, yes. So, meaning to say, we can avail the 3% discount. So, ang magiging discount rate natin is 0 0.03. Solving this in your calculator, our final answer is... 27,500, open parenthesis, 1 minus 0 0.03, close parenthesis. The answer is 26,000, 
675. That's it for problem number 3.